The Fountain of Life in Cathedral City is a favorite place for local families to cool down during the hot months. But now that fountain needs structural updates, so it's surrounded by a gate and the water is off. News Channel 3's Miyoshi Price found out what's next and says kids will no longer be allowed to climb on that fountain. That's right, Karen. The fountain has not been operational for six months. The city hired a structural engineer team in February to assess the damages and found that the fountain is unsafe for climbing. Well, it looks cool, but there's no water going through it. We just looked it up online and uh, said kids like to play on it, so we came here, but it was uh, looks like it shut down. Dave Pura and his family are vacationing from Canada and trying to stay cool. He was surprised to find the fountain of life in Cathedral City was dry. It was revealed a number of uh, potential slip and fall issues, soft surface deterioration, um, you know, uh, uh, cracking issues that could potentially be um, a, a liability and a safety risk for our residents. City Communications Director Ryan Hunt says the fountain of life is not closed for good, but when the water turns on in two weeks, a new rule will be in place. It just won't be a climbable feature moving forward. But Hunt says there are other ways to stay cool. We'll also have banners and instructions of, of ways you can cool off in the community of how residents can interact with that. And we have water features at both Ocotillo Park and Panorama Park. More changes are still ahead for the Fountain of Life, but the conceptual designs are being discussed. So it's very challenging, both from a safety standpoint and from a cost perspective, to be able to maintain. This fence is meant to keep people out of the fountain but Hunt says people can enjoy the surrounding sculptures. The Pure family did just that. Little Wells Pure offers this advice on staying cool. Swim, swimming. Yeah. What else? Walking. And drinking water. The city has a partnership with PSUSD's Cathedral City High School to use their pool. Those instructions will be posted on banners around the gate that is blocking the Fountain of Life. Live in studio, Miyoshi Price, News Channel 3.